Hi, in this quick video tutorial, we are going to be building an RC low pass filter and then simulating it both in the time domain and in the frequency domain. So I'm going to hop over to my circuit lab editor here and just drop a resistor in. Oops, drop that backwards. And a capacitor and a voltage source. And I'm going to wire those up together. So I'm going to drop a ground into my circuit. And I'm also going to name some nodes. Always a very good practice to name your inputs and your output nodes at least and anything else you might want to be looking at in your circuit. So I got my V in, my V out. I'm going to change that to a 10 microfarad capacitor. The other thing I'm going to do is this sine wave that I dropped in here. I'm going to change that into a square wave because this is a low pass filter. So I want to see it filtering that square wave and hop over to the simulate tab and then click on out and in. So it graphs those as the outputs and then run the time domain simulation. And there you have it. V in is a square wave and V out is a filtered version of that square wave. So that's cool. Let's see what else can I do here? I can take um, this 100 ohm resistor and I can make that much bigger, right? That's the R in my RC circuit. And then simulate that again, hit F5. And now you see the filter is a much stronger filter. RC is larger. You get a squashed, more squashed down version of the square wave. The other super cool thing you can do in Circuit Lab is you can run a frequency domain simulation. So I can hop over to the frequency domain tab here, and then I click V8 for my input, because that's this uh, square wave here. And for my output, I'm just going to hit V out, and it automatically drops in the magnitude and the phase at V out. So I run this frequency domain simulation. You can see these Bode plots here. If you don't know what this is, don't worry about it. But if you do know what this is, you can see how powerful this is for running frequency analysis on a circuit. There you have it, an RC low-pass filter.